G'day guys, today I'm going to be doing a review on the app called Player Extreme. Um, basically, I've got it down on my tab at the bottom, open it up. Um, basically, it's a video library player that you can um, play movies. Um, at this stage, I've only tried AVI files, but they seem to work fine. You can basically um, open page here you've got your library which tells you your open gives you the ones that you've actually downloaded to your iPad um, if you go to network all right this brings up all your PCs computers in the in your uh, Wi-Fi area um, it's then you click on Wi-Fi, which you can transfer files wirelessly directly to a computer. It gives you the HTTP address and the web web address. And if you click on Downloads, um, this is where you can actually download movies from your PC, say in your lounge room, to your iPad in your bedroom. Um, if you want to watch a movie, you can download the actual movie to the iPad. Uh, in Settings, you've got... Um, uh, when you buy the basic app, it gives you the general settings, the library settings. Um, there's like X12 Sound Boost, that's an add-on. Um, subtitles is an add-on, and security is an add-on. You pay about 99 cents per add-on, so it's not it's not that expensive. Um, if you go to the next screen, which is your add-ons, um, well, the new upgradable player to the Extreme Pro is 2.99. I've got the cheap version. I think it was 99 cents. Um, subtitles is 99 cents, as you can see the sound is 99 cents, access network drivers I paid that already, that's 99 cents, um, HTTP Wi-Fi transfer is 99 cents, I paid for those so that I can watch movies basically from my, in my bedroom off my PC, um, and there's a, another one down there called VGA out, Dropbox so you can sync it to your Dropbox on the internet so you can have all your you know, movies stored on the internet and when you're um, out and about at someone else's house or visiting somewhere that you can get, get internet, you can connect to the internet and then go to your Dropbox and basically download and watch one of your movies. Um, then we've got the help which basically takes you straight to the internet to their website and it goes through step by step of um, all the things that you need help with. Now if you go back to network, now here it's come up all the PCs in my house basically, plus the ones that are close by near your house, but uh, my computer is the radio. If I open that up, so that opens up into your the PC that you've connected to. Uh, now I have all my movie going to users, open. Public, open, then I have all my uh, folders here that I've used that I've allowed the public access to. So if you go into videos, open, now there are all the, just a few movies that I've got in my uh, shared users folder on my PC that so when I go to bed of a night I can basically um, either download one of these to watch or watch it. So if I click on a movie that uh, let's just say ooh, The Walking Dead. You see, it comes up with a little screen there. You can either download, play, or info. If you click on play, up comes the main display screen. And once it starts to buffer, you can get loaded up. It all depends on your, net, on your network speed, too, your internet speed, and how fast you here um, through these movies but it seems to be very slow my internet today but normally that opens up pretty fast and then we go through to the um different movie you want to watch it comes up like a normal player you can drag it across play from another section but when you drag it across it will have to buffer as if you're watching it off the internet but apart from that it is really good so that's basically it guys um it does everything that I need a video player to do for me. Um, it's pretty good for the price. It does lag a little bit. It does crash occasionally. So whether the upgrading 
to the pro version the t for 299 um, might be worth the three dollars it might have better better, better functionality but apart from that it's basically a very good app does what i need to do and um that's about all i've got for it um thank you for watching this video thank you for looking at my channel please subscribe and like this video um, and i will see you next time guys bye